start the play we're focusing on getting to a shorter cycle time, approximately a half an hour to an hour, without the auxiliary materials that we would use, uh, in the end to make it sustainable technology. The slitter tape that we just cut is now being placed with our automated laser-assisted fiber placement machine on the mandrel, which is rotating. And we're actually placing two parts at once. So after placement, this beam is cut in two, so two parts at once. So we just created the flat stack, the pre pack stack, with our ATL machine. It's a rather quick process where the tapes are placed on top of each other. You can see the, the flat preform over here. We also we added the glass ply on the top and the bottom of the of the prepack stack, and now it's ready for preforming. Yeah, Leung is going to operate the machine, position the blank into the oven, heating it, and then forming it. And the forming itself is rather quick to prevent the heat loss of the blank of the the preform. So this is the last step. After this, it will be trimming an NDI. So typically we will, be, we will be loading the tool into the press. The press will close, as we see now. Uh, after the press is closed, uh, we're going to uh, put the, the locking mechanism on the, on the press. And that's actually the starting point for the, for the final consolidation. With a thermal tool, it's being heated up into the press. We're using uh, fire hoses to put pressure, to get the pressure on the part and to achieve the final consolidation quality. The press is ready for, yeah, for, for starting the real process, heating, constant phase, and then cooling. I'm feeling really proud. We are now in a phase where we're going to a full-scale spar of 3.5 meters in length, with all the, the full-scale elements in there for a V-tail application. It's a flying demonstrator, which is important. So it's more a, a ramp up to, towards a full-scale part.